All right, what's this one? Crazy order for Elizabeth W. Okay, these I, I've seen orders like these before, and they are actually just catastrophic. Plonker. Plonker. All right, let's have a look at this. Pyro, I can be your personal chef. I mean, you're a sushi chef. You're just going to make me sushi all day? Sushi's quite fattening. I'd have sashimi. Sashimi's good for you. Right, let's have a look at this. Elizabeth's order from Dunkin' Donuts. This will be the most American thing I've seen in my life. Every time I go into a Dunkin' Donuts, it's just like pure diabetes. Like, like that, that, that is just so, like, I think the lowest calorie donut is like 500 calories. Okay, one, one teaspoon of sugar. Not too bad. Two teaspoons of sugar. Bro, it says 20 sugar. 20 sugar. 20 sugar on the side of the order. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. The blood sugar. It's over. It's actually okay to have some coffee. It's okay. And then a flavor shot of vanilla concentrated flavor shot. And I imagine that that has mad sugar in it as well. That has mad sugar in it. Eight. French vanilla. One. And, 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 and then the French vanilla as well. The French vanilla. Eight French vanilla. Vanilla shots. I, I can't get over the 20 sugar. I can't get over that. Like, like the, the shots themselves probably have so much sugar in it. And then you're having sugar on top of that. She's dead in 20 minutes. This is like something a character I would commission would drink. Like, you cannot drink this as an actual human and hope to survive. No wonder everyone in America is so rotund. Oh my god. 20 sugars. Look at that. It's like halfway full. Where's the coffee? Where's the coffee? Where, where is the coffee? What was that? Was that milk? Was, it, was, that, was, it, was, that, was that the milk? Is that it? That's all the protein you're getting. That's it. That's it. That's, that, that is the healthiest thing you added. Jesus Christ. And then the ice. Oh, it's just how the sugar is sitting there at the bottom, man. Why is it sitting there at the bottom? That's disgusting. And there's the coffee. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. yep. I feel sick. Like, I, I, I drink double espressos. This makes me feel sick. Mix that sugar up as well. Mix that sugar up. Please mix it. Please mix it. I'm begging. It's not mixing. No, you're not done. You're not done. Why does the video end there? You're not done. Look at all that, like, like the sediment. It's not what you find at the bottom of a lake. Just sediment. Just sat. That's disgusting. Elizabeth, you are at least 800 pounds. You are at least 800 pounds in weight. All right, let's see what else they got. I it, this account is actually annoying me right now. I got I got to see what else. Let's see. Didn't even mix it. Ethan's order. Let's see what Ethan orders. Oh, this is a big one. Sugar. They have to be making these as clip baiting, right? They have to be. There's there's no way people are this fat. There's, there's no way. You're literally rage bait? Yeah, no, I, it has to be. There's no way. The vanilla concentrated flavor. The, the blueberry. That just that just looks like like toilet cleaner. That looks like ethanol. That that looks like rubbing alcohol. That's disgusting. Toasted. What what is toasted? What the hell is toasted flavor shot? Please stop. Please, please, please. You know what the worst thing is about America? I went there once. They don't even use milk in their coffee. They have, like, creamer. I, I, I thought it was a meme, but when I went there, like, four years ago, I was like, what the hell is creamer? And it's just, it's just like, fat people milk. Please stop. Please stop. Half, half the cup is full already. Please stop. Dude, you could actually just eat the ice in that, and that's probably still about 300 calories just from what it's been sitting in. 
What is this? That's water. Probably the healthiest thing that's been added to water. And then a little bit of coffee. Please mix it properly. Eight butter scone peach, four vanilla shots, three toasted shots, four blueberry shots, nine sugars, oat milk, and cold foam. Please mix it properly. Why are you using like a drink mixing spoon that you'd use with like alcohol, like cocktails? Okay, I mean that one stirred better. I still see it collecting at the bottom. That's awful. There's gotta there's gotta be more. This one is 16 million. This is gonna be absolutely painful. This this one is gonna be infuriating to watch. I know the women in the comments are gonna be like, um, I have that every day. <laughs> Christine sees order. Look, look how much sugar is there. Look at that. Like, like whoever ordered this, you can hear them before you see them. I feel like I'm doing a friendly fire thing right now with, with, with what I commission and stuff. I, I really feel like I do, but I feel like I really need to speak on this, man. Like, th this is bad. This is, this is really, really bad. Look at that. It looks like milk. There's so much sat down there. Please stop. Please stop. Just, just have an espresso. Just, just have a double espresso or an Americano, please. Just, you, you could just have a latte or a cappuccino even. Like, like uh, uh, that's fine. Please stop. Please stop. Someone in chat said friendly fire will not be tolerated. <laughs> Okay, the almond milk. I actually use almond milk that's like sugar-free. I don't know how it's sugar-free, but it's like, it, it's so good for like a protein mix, like a protein shake. That probably isn't sugar-free. There's only a little bit though, not too bad. I like how she added less almond milk than there is sugar. That is crazy. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Look, you just see the, the sugar just sat there in the corner. As someone who is a barista for a certain siren, this is 100% common and 100% disturbing every time. Please, God, just get a double espresso. Please, God. Like, like it wakes you up and it's like 10 calories. Please, God. Just, just, oh no. Oh no. I don't even want to know how many calories are in that. I, I don't, I don't even want to watch that. I don't even want to watch that one. All right, what else we got? Crazy order at 11 a.m. Americans eat and drink <laughs> like they have free healthcare. <laughs> it's just, it's so, they, they have so much French vanilla. You don't need the sugar if you're having the pumps. The pumps already have so much sugar in them. All the sugar and then skim on the milk, la mau. They actually put skim milk. They put skim milk. This is like, this is like when someone will literally eat their body weight in like candy and then be like, oh, I'm actually having a Coke Zero. I'm having a Coke Zero, guys. It's okay. It, it cancels it out. Like, I remember this Family Guy skit and it was like this fat woman and then she has a Diet Coke and, and then she goes, no, I can eat anything. It's like, so true. This makes you want to start eating healthier. No, it's it's insane. It's insane. Like whenever I finish a workout, I wanna like I, I'd never want junk food. I always wanna like, eat healthy. But this the hatred I'm getting from this video is actually supercharged that. I wanna go on like a water fast after watching this video. Ham beast. 
All right, we got any others, or is that it? I'm kind of hoping that's it. I want to see the Zavara one, because the Vara ones will just cause outrage. All right, last one. This is for Ava. Ten sugars. Ten sugars. I've seen people have, like, tea, and they put two sugars in, and I'm like, that's quite a lot. Ten sugars. Ten. Oh my god. Please stop. Mocha swirl. That probably has more sugar in it, compressed, than the actual spoonfuls of sugar. Oh, I like the way that came out. Dude, it looks like ass, man. Stirring. 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 No. God, what is wrong with Americans? What is actually wrong with Americans, like, unironically? Brandon Food, what does he do? I am a regular food reviewer. Okay, what are you reviewing? We got Jack in the Box. I've never had Jack in the Box before, but I- Dude, what happened to his face? What ha what happened to his face? What? Did he get into a fight or something before recording this? I guess the Cubes deal has all the hits. First up, I've heard this time- he, Dude, he got beat up there. Like, he got beat up there, like, like, like several days ago. Like, like, look at that. That bruising is still there. Might be the what are the what are the comments saying? Brandon R food reviews jumped. Bro had to box Jack. Who did this to you? Best taco in the fast food game. Looks like there's sauce, cheese. Lettuce. How is he acting so normal? He was forced to review. Yeah, he went in and gave it a one star. I can't tell if that's meat or beans because I, I got a little bit of blood in my eye. <laughs> Well, that's good. Okay, I can see what the hype is about. Next up, and apparently also- Okay, I don't know what's worse. The fact that he got beaten up and did this review, or he's holding his curly fries like that. Come on, man, have some decorum. You grab it with two fingers. I don't want grease on, like, my pinky and my ring finger. That's so disgusting. Iconic. The curly fries. Eat like an actual human, please. Maybe- Nah, I think he deserved to get beat. I'm not gonna lie. I think he actually deserved it. Okay, I like the seasoning a lot. It's just a little hard to eat. I can't tell if the fries are a little... Best day in Detroit. ...stale or if my jaw is just dislocated. Next up, we got this chicken bacon melt. Chicken, hash browns, bacon, cheese on kind of a croissant. Is there a single vegetable in that? Like, even I'm, I'm e even a bit of fruit. I'm just asking for a sliced tomato, man. That's all I want. Maybe a pickle. Like one of those McDonald's burgers you get, and they just have like a little... A, a paper-thin slice of pickle on top. It looks like the gif of like Mickey Mouse cutting into the bread and it's just like paper. Croissant bun. It looks amazing, but it kind of smells like, kind of smells like glass. Full disclosure, when I went to Jack in the Box, I accidentally got thrown through a window. It was all just a big misunderstanding. I was there, there was this women's roller derby team that was ahead of me and they got mad at me and threw me through a window because they thought I was trying to steal their order. In their defense, I genuinely thought he just gave the place a one star. I was trying to steal their order. I didn't know they'd notice. Still a big fan though. Mm -hmm. Oh, I almost forgot about the mini churros. <sighs> okay, that that was funny until the end. Then he tried too hard. He he shouldn't he shouldn't have explained the joke. I think I think he should have just like gone on. It, it would have been funnier if he didn't acknowledge it. But then when he explained the joke, like that that then it died. Then it died. Yeah, it was react Andy. That is crazy to me. All right, let's look at this one. I tried the worst reviewed restaurant. In London. Today we're going to be trying the worst rated restaurant in London. I came here five years ago and now we're back. Recently, there have been some five star reviews saying. I know this restaurant. It's a restaurant that's located like right next to Buckingham Palace and the reviews for it are just absolutely horrendous. Don't believe all this bad press. It's actually really not that bad. So we've got to check it out. It can't be that bad. By the way, if the woman that served me four or five years ago is there, I'm genuinely going to be scared. Just know that. It looks atrocious. I'm just going to do a sneak kind of 
Oh, she's coming out. Oh my God, it's her. <laughs> she's here. Oh no. Right, let's do this. Hi there, how you doing? How are you? Is it right to have a table for two? What would you like to order first? Uh, have you got a menu? Yeah. Probably an all day breakfast and a uh, fish and chips. What are those? Oh my God, bro, a sandwich. A, a curry chicken sandwich is 14 pounds. A chicken avocado and bacon sandwich is 14 pounds. Chicken and bacon is 14 pounds. A jacket potato with only cheese is 15 pounds. 50 pence. Onion rings are 11 pounds. A salad platter with cheese is 17 pound 50. That is, the, these are the worst prices I've ever seen in my life. That is fleecing. Like that, that is like prime tourist area in London as well. So they go in there and they're like, oh, it's a traditional like, like London cafe. And then they get rinsed. I'm not selling, sorry. You're not selling? Okay. <laughs> Not even an all-day breakfast? Unlucky. Nothing. I think this guy actually went in and gave a negative review before, though, and the woman's recognized him. Okay. Can I get a sandwich to go? Nothing. 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 Can I get some crisps? No. No crisps. No. To be fair, though, to be fair, he did, like, do a review, like, saying this place was awful, and then he goes back in expected to be treated well, so it's like, eh. Is everything okay? All right, have a good day. Well, that was a good YouTube video. <laughs> right, guys, it's been doing some thinking. I'm going to come back next week. I'm going to put a disguise on, and I'm going to try the food. If you're seeing this video... Just, just leave her alone, man. You already gave it a negative. Just leave her alone. Oh, my God. Give it a rest. Let me see... Uh... Today we're gonna I think this is him actually going inside. Is it? No, this is the one we just watched. Uh, where is it? He did do one where he traveled there. I'm pretty sure. Uh, see if we can find it. I don't know if I can find it. Right, I gotta use TikTok search bar. This will get me nothing. Yep, yeah, actually just actually just nothing. Such a useless tool, the search bar. It's absolutely useless. I see these a lot on TikTok and I don't like them. Let's make my water of the day. Oh, what flavor So that was just water, okay. What flavor You could just drink that. Right, just shut up for a minute. I need to watch this. Let's make my water of the day. Oh, what flavor am I getting? Is he wearing makeup though? I don't mind, but is he? Or is that just his skin complexion? I genuinely can't tell. Choose today. I am going to go for a Sonic Ocean Water. Sonic Ocean Water. Can you not just drink water, please? And then I'm also going to be using one of these blueberry high C packets. These have honestly become one of my favorite packets to use because it tastes like blueberry jello. It just tastes so good. Okay. You could just drink water. You could genuinely just drink water. I'm gonna go ahead and start with- Instead of making like sun issue water. The blueberry. Let's give that a little mixeroony. I am going to add in my ice. You know, I need a lot. And in addition to ice, I'm going to add in some dazzle dust, which is just edible glitter. I haven't added this to one of my water of the day. Oh, my microplastics! My, my, my microplastics! For this one. This Look looks, at that. this looks disgusting. Look at that. Shining shimmer. Actual microplastics. Spring splendid. This is juice. This is not water. Now I'm going to take my second water bottle. It stops being water as soon as you add, like, anything into it that changes the color to, like, blue or red. Bottle. Oh. I just realized I didn't want to use ocean water today. I actually wanted to use a grape flavor. My bad. We're doing Wild Purple Smash instead. Can't do blue on blue. All right, half a packet is going into this here. Let's give that a shake. Okay, now I'm going to layer the grape. Like, no meme. No wonder we're literally all getting cancer, right? Like, he, he has this plastic water bottle that's probably been sat in his cupboard for ages. Maybe even when it's being delivered to his... The shop he bought it from is exposed to sunlight. All the microplastics are leaching in. And then he's just adding all this, like, sugar garbage. And even if it's, like, even if it's sugar-free, it's, like, he's adding in so many sweeteners. Just drink water, bro! Like, I get bored of water. And then sometimes I drink sparkling water. And then sometimes I get bored of sparkling water. And then I drink tonic water. Like, this is sugar-free. It's still got all these, like, horrible... I mean, what, what's this got in it? Let me look. It's meant to be healthier for you. It's probably got stevia. 
Yeah, it's got it's got stevia in it, like which is like a natural sweetener. Like it's not much better than like asparatame or sucralose, but still. Grape right on over my blueberry. I'm gonna pour it slowly over the ice. See if that'll layer. It looking like it is. One of the ice cubes shifted and. How is he making a Coke Zero look healthy? That's the crazy thing. Almost foiled my plan. I'm gonna leave a little bit of room at the top because I wanna add some cotton candy skinny syrup. This one also has some edible glitter. Skinny in it, syrup. Really cool. So I am going to just pour this. Skinny syrup with edible glitter. Right on over the top. Please stop. And then we are done. All right, here it is. This is the second galaxy inspired. Look at the amount of glitter in that. Look at the amount of glitter. Someone said Estonia flag water. Fired water. <laughs> Cancer water. This one looks My 24 pack of Dr. Pepper is healthier. Yeah, probably. Pretty darn cool. If I do say so myself. Let's Just drink a beer at this point. Let's give it a mix so I can taste it. And let's see if it tastes as cute. The first sip feels like heaven. The second takes him there. Dude, it looks. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, dude, it looks like oil slick. Look at that. Oh, of course. Some of my favorite flavors. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong with raw sediment, guys. You really can't. Is there, another, is there any others he's done? I think he kind of fell off, so he stopped. So there's pinned videos. All right, let's have a look. Let's make my water of the day. How far can I go? I didn't even it's like when I see people that drink like a liter and a half, two liters of like Coke Zero and like, it, and they drink no water. It's like, no wonder you feel ill all the time. Feel that time. What flavor am I going to make today? Hmm, I'm thinking that I'm going to try the cherry limeade Sonic packet. During my second year of med school, I knew a guy who drank only Coke and instead of water. God put him mega because he could control the fat. <laughs> Play the Stanley Parable, it's on sale on Steam right now. I think I'm still maggot. Yes, that did. I think I'm still maggot on, uh, to be honest. And I also want to do the kiwi lime and Skittles. So it's looking like it's going to be a Christmas theme, green and red going on. Christmas theme. Okay, I'm going in. Christmas theme water. I like how the top comment is, OMG, you should try water next. With the Sonic Cherry Limeade, and we're just gonna- Who comes up with these names, bro? Sonic Cherry Lime. Like, I, I swear, they, they add the worst words. Blood, Blood Moon Red. Put that as our base. Blood Moon Strawberry. Give it a little mix a -rooney. Oh, uh, bro, that is like the most red. That that will glow in the dark if you turn the lights off. That's the most red forty thing I've seen in my entire life. Imagine the kidney stones. I'm gonna try something different and I'm gonna add the cherry syrup to the base of this. So hopefully it'll like make it thicker and it'll make the layering of the green part a lot easier. Hopefully this works. Now I'm gonna add in all of my ice. My second water bottle, I'm gonna try to add like half of the kiwi lime packet just so we get that green color. Let's mix that baby up. He's actually making a drink that looks like a Hallmark Christmas movie. Now it's time for the moment of truth. Is this going to layer better? Let's find out. Got to pour it on the ice to create the layer. There's no layer there, bro. Please layer beautifully. There's no layer. I don't know. Is it working? It's not working. It's just becoming orange. It's working. I nope. see green on top. That's a bit of a cope seeing green so on cool. top with that. We have our How is that a Christmas drink? That looks like an Aperol spritz. How is that a Christmas drink? Christmas water. The layer could have been a little bit Pyro, better, but I think... can you check out the website, Favorite? It would be interesting to see the reviews to your main channel and your Slop channel, and to your biggest competitor, Slop Live, which are rated better than Pyro Live. How sad for you. Showing Dolan is king. What's Favorite? I can definitely see the green here. I don't know. Let me know what you rate this layer on a scale of 1 through 10. Now it's time to give this baby a Can I give negative points? Can I please give negative points? And let's taste it. I mean, this is going to be good. We got cherry, we got lime, and we got kiwi. So it's going to be good. And the color is beautiful. So yup, just as I thought, delicious. Let Imagine if you gave him sparkling water and it just changed his entire life so he would not need to add like all this garbage into his water every day.
Yeah, let's watch one more. Let's make my water of the day. So satisfying every time. What flavor am I gonna choose today? We're actually going with the Skittles original. It's crazy how as well this guy only blew up on TikTok because it's bright colors that the kids watch. Like, there's something so dystopian about that. Like, it's he's literally just trying to make the brightest concoction. He's going to break, like, a glow stick at one point and put the fluid in there. I am going to do a base of green apple, the green apple Skittles, and then on... You should use a Radex. <laughs> well, no, it's Radaway, isn't it? Radex just fortifies you against radiation, so you should take a Radex before drinking this. Pop, I want to do a grape. All right, I'm going in with the green apple first. Let's give that a little mix Rudy, shall we? If I ever ate an apple that green... I would definitely think they added colors into it. That is not a natural color. Add in my ice, you know I need a lot. Adds one tablespoon of sugar to the water. Wow, this is so good. I think all of it's sugar-free. I'm not sure because the sachet he added was only five calories. Now to my second water bottle. I'm going to add in the grape packet, but I'm only going to do like about half if I can. And it's going to kind of match my sweater right now. I finished Portal watching your stream yesterday and finished Portal 2 watching... Finish Portal 2 today while watching your stream, lol. Based. Let's shake that up. Now, moment of truth. Will this layer? Let's find out. I'm going to just pour it slowly over the top. And try to just like... You need like... You need like the Geiger counter sound. <laughs> He's gonna add like 1,000 rads a second at the top. It's 10,000 rads a second. What are you doing? And it's looking like we have what? Like an incredible Hulk water, maybe even the Joker with the green and purple going the, on. Did he call it Joker water? Did he just call it Joker water? So is eating banana candy the same as eating a banana now? <laughs> it looks pretty cool. Now let's It literally just looks like green sludge that someone took a shit in. Like, how does this look good? Mix it. I know. I know. Everybody always gets mad when I mix it, but you have to mix it to get all the... Okay, flavor. that just looks like slop now. That's like power alive water. Look at that. It does not look... Look at that. That's awful! That's appealing now, but we're going to try it anyways. I'm sure it's going to be good. <laughs> Yep, yep. Looks like he's really enjoying that. Ooh. That is definitely a keeper. Instantly one of my new favorite waters. I said it. Let's make... What is wrong with Americans, man? Like, for real. New side quest unlocked. NYC. Oh, wait. Did he meet Pokemon? You're a private chef for a streamer in Beverly Hills. Stop saying stand up. I'm not bricked. Stop saying stand up. Oh, damn. Is that the San Pellegrino, though? I, I mean... I mean, I do be a fan. I, I do be a fan of San Pellegrino. I do be a little bit of a fan. I... Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I... I, I do be a little bit of a fan. I got, like, 20 more crates of these. I do be a little bit of a San Pellegrino fan. I, okay, you know what? Maybe me and Pokemon got off on the wrong foot. Maybe we got off on the wrong foot. <laughs> Holy alcoholic, it's, it's sparkling water. Yeah, it's just, it's all full of vodka. I just watched this and I think, wow, I would love to learn how to cook. But then it's like, Nah. Nah. I have dealt with depression and I've felt suicidal before mainly because when everything's been dragging you down. Dragged you by the hair and pulled you to the ground, if you wanna get up. You need a little revive. If you wanna get up you need to fart. You need a little revive. Is, isn't that the revive soda? Bit? 
Is that actually the revive? Is that quick revive? Is that actually quick? Is that is that is that the lyrics of quick revive? Really? The depression and stuff. Wow, I I knew I knew the I need a little revive. Like no, I actually thought that was a guy like pouring his heart out to me in chat. Damn. Damn, to have a private chef though, that's like mad money. Because they are they are expensive. I just get my mummy and daddy to cook for me. My mummy and daddy do all my food. I, I do get it though, because it's like you're a streamer, and it's like if you're cooking, you're technically taking time away where you could be making Hilo, money. Me and your mom have decided to send you to AA for your alcoholism. Look, I'm gonna look, I'm gonna stop, alright? This is my last vodka. This is my last vodka, I promise, okay? I didn't know that San Pellegrino made vodka. So like any other job? Yeah, true. But I guess streaming, it's not really like a nine to five, like the hours can vary. You might work like two hours a day. You might work 20 hours a day. Like imagine if you were doing a 24 hour stream, like you can't make food. You can't because you're like, you know, you're too busy uh, streaming. I'm not defending it. I'm just thinking about like how it's unscheduled hours. Look, I'm just trying to not attack Pokemon, okay? I'll admit it. I'll admit it. I, w I want to be nice for once, okay? Because I've made so many videos, like, being snide. I, I want to be in a corner for once, okay? That is, like... That looks so Instagrammable. That looks so Instagrammable. Look at the little banana on top. Where is the protein? I know she's a woman, but like, where is that it? Hello, Byro. Old Dutch fan that has not been up to date with your streams for the last two years. Dot. I saw you looked at the juiced Klein Eurovision situation. Dot. And I wondered if you saw his latest music video as a symbolic response. Dot. It is in the style of old PS2. I did not cube, but I might check it out. Thank you. There is like ten calories on that plate. It's actually insane. Like, like the macros probably go hard, right? For, I don't know. Also, is that is that seaweed? I swear that stuff has like insane sugar. That stuff actually isn't that healthy. But to be fair, he's probably made it himself. Is that tuna or is that is that ginger? I can't even tell. I think it's tuna. There is no protein on that plate. I feel I don't know. Like, I feel like it is prepared well, but it's almost like they're doing the presentation first. And then the actual macros afterwards. I could just be talking out my ass though. I mean, it looks it looks pretty balanced. It does look balanced. But he's definitely making it with the intention of making it like presentable, like on a stream or something. But I guess I guess that's part of your job when you're like a East Celeb Chef. Like, I know that would keep me full for about five minutes. She's gorgeous. <laughs> How much was that? Fish meat bull mix, $8. How much for $8? Surely that's weighted, right? That's not $8 per ball. Imagine he just ends up shopping at that. What's that place in LA? That's like the most expensive grocery market in America. There's like a place in LA that all like the actors and all the celebrities go to. Someone in chat will definitely know it. Imagine if he, he just went there to get like all of his stuff. Just so he could absolutely rinse people. Whole Foods? No. Era one. Era one. That's right. Era one. Whole Foods is pretty expensive, though, from what I've heard. I think it's all organic or something. There was one in the Netherlands when I went. I do love those mushrooms. I'm not sure what those mushrooms are called, but the long ones, like, they can imitate meat so well. They're so good. They're so good. This one's for you. Water? Water. How do you say Let's see if this broth is actually good. That's good. What kind of regular... All this food we have. The bok choy. That's exactly what you have. Oh, like, Interesting. I can't. Shiitake mushrooms? I don't think it's shiitake. Enoki. I think it is enoki mushrooms. That's a guy? <laughs> yes. That's what most people say when they go on my Instagram and see pictures of me dressed as a woman. She looks pretty cute. So it's 
trying to be a force of good. What do we do like when we retire? Like, I think we. Yeah, it's time. There's something a bit weird about sitting down and like eating with your chef. It's like, oh yeah, I made this food for you that you paid for. Uh, I'm just gonna film us so I can put it on my TikTok. <clears throat> I wish I had a personal chef. I wish I did. But then again, like I said, mummy and daddy cook all my food for me. Uh, what's this one? I've officially hit unk status. What does unk status mean again? It's like when you're a boomer, right? What's 9 plus 10? Am I the only confused person here? Wait, there's no way. There's no way they have no idea what 9 plus 10 means. Explain to me how 9 plus 10 equals 21. How is it 21? Oh my god, we're cooked. We're cooked. We're cooked. It's it's done. It's the fact that it has so many updates as well. Like like the new gens. What what do the new gens have? They have skibbity toilet and that's it. They actually have nothing. They don't even know what 9 plus 10 is. Are you serious? Am I that old? Nah, there's no way. There's no way. There's no- oh my god. It, it, stuff like this reminds me that TikTok is actually just full of nine-year-olds. Explain to me how 9 plus 10 equals 21. Am I the only confused person here? I do hate that. The, the worst thing in the world is when you go into the TikTok comments and there's like a really bad take and it's got so many upvotes. Like people agreed with that. It's 19. What you all wrong, it's 19. Anyone here from 2030, bro, it's 19. If 10 plus 10 is 20, so 10 plus 9 must be 19. I can't, th th this is so bad. This is so bad. Oh, he was going around asking people what, what 9 plus 10 is. I mean, okay, okay, him not getting it, like, he looks like he just, you know, he looks like he was in World War II. So that's fine. Like, you ask a boomer that? Fair enough. That, that, that's fine. There's no, there's no issue there. But the new gen's not getting it? Come on, we have a responsibility, man. We gotta teach the youth. We gotta tell them what 9 plus 10 is. 21. We all came back here because of the blue comment. How, man? I still don't understand how 9 plus 10 equals 21. It's 19. Stranger things. Yep. Stranger things. Actual 7-year-old girl there. God damn. 19 is correct. It's 19. It is 19. It's the Ohio answer 21. When was this? 2023? Okay, no, that's that's when Ohio was actually like a meme. Okay. It's 19. It's 19. 9, 10, 21. No, it's not crying emoji. Flower picture and hearts. That is actually a 10-year-old. It's 19. How are they not getting it? How are they? I'm not that old, bro. I'm not that old. There's no way. Nah, man, it's 19. God. God. Lock them out of their phones, man. Please get them off the internet. Get them off the internet. I am gatekeeping TikTok right now. I'm gatekeeping it. Like, like the, these new gens, they, they have no idea what, what, what 9 plus 10 is.